And well, a special visitor for some special Kansas City children today, children who are visually impaired. But this visitor is helping them see that their futures are still very bright. I pledge allegiance to the flag. It's a morning tradition at the Children's Center for the Visually Impaired, but this time it's a little different. For which it stands. Amy Dixon is here to say the pledge with them. Just like some of these kids, Amy can barely see. Well, I can only see part of somebody's face. The further away they are, the more I can see. Amy lost 97% of her vision to a rare inflammatory eye disease, but she hasn't let it slow her down. His tail! His tail! With the help of her guide dog Elvis and some special people in her life, she turned herself into a world-class paratriathlete. She's currently ranked sixth in the world. For me, when I started losing my vision, I didn't realize that there was a, a very high level of function that you could have as a visually impaired or blind person. She's traveled here from Connecticut to share that message with these Kansas City kids. To be able to meet these kids and show them that, yes, you know, just because you can't see very well or at all, there are a million things you can do. You just do them a little bit differently. And just to kind of show some of the kids that, that um, even with visual impairments, you can overcome your disability and you can do other things like with your life. Sometimes, though, the kids just want to tell her stories. It should ever, ever end up. That's true. It's not polite. It's not polite. Amy's story is just beginning. Her next stop, the 2016 Paralympics in Rio. Her biggest stage yet to inspire. Just training, 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 and uh, getting ready to ramp it up. And Amy's story captured the attention of the Today Show. She'll be featured on Today tomorrow morning. She'll also be back here in Kansas City in April for CCVI's big fundraiser, the Trolley Run. Good luck beating Amy in that one. Still to come here on the Now KC, a lot more coming up.